Hello everyone, welcome back to GK Plays. We're playing another retro game. It's Turtles, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 4. Turtles in Time. Oh, hello, we've got a bit of a demo going on there. Let's not have a look at that just yet. So, let's get stuck in. However, I'm going to look at the options very quickly. Uh, normal. Awesome. Let's uh, jump straight in then. Now, I've had a little bit of practice with this, um, and I, de I think I want Raph. I quite, I quite like Raph. He's cool. Yeah, I've had a little bit of practice, but I've not played the game through or anything like Oh, Raph. All right. Thanks for stealing the Statue of Liberty, I guess. Yeah, bring the Statue back, douche nozzle. Oh, bloated, or bloated bean bag. We'll go with that, too. Big Apple, 3 a.m. Okay, so yeah, I've literally just played like a bit of the first stage, that's it. Just to get a good uh, handle on the controls. And I found that uh, I tried all the turtles and Raph was by far the fastest and I quite like having a bit of, having a bit of speed. But yeah, we've got some uh, beam up action here. Which is ultra, ultra cool. Now, I remember playing uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles when I was a kid, and oh my god, I loved it. Like, the old cartoon, I thought it was great. Ooh, pizza. And the object of the game is obviously, to, it's, it's very straightforward, is to go from left to right, beat everything up. Beat a boss, move on. <coughs> it's fairly straightforward. And each turtle has a special move as well, but it actually takes like life away from you because it's so damn strong. Oh yeah, that's... There is a myriad of uh, really cool moves you can do whilst playing this. So you can throw people, you can like... You can do all sorts. I'm loving it. I, 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 I think this is awesome. I want to do the slam again. How do I do that? There we go. It's a great clearer. Oh, we've got our first boss. This is Baxter. Seven of the turtles. Alright. Now, that's the special I was talking about, but it actually, like I said, it takes a chunk of life off, which you don't want. Don't laugh at me, sunshine. Come down here and laugh. Come on. I don't want to lose a, lose a life on the first stage if I can help it. Come on. There he goes. <laughs> Car bunger indeed. This game's freaking awesome. I love it. <coughs> Excuse my cough. I've got a bit of a bit of a cough on. Luckily, it is just a cough, thankfully. So, uh, scene two, Alicat Blues. So yeah, I tried all the turtles, and to be honest, I really liked Raph. I thought he was the quickest by far. And again, I've not like, looked at guides or anything like that. I don't know which one the best one is. Or anything like that. I just I just like Raph. He controls how I would want to control him. But yeah, uh, Leo was always the, the sort of the well-balanced one. He was the... He was always everyone's favourite, I think. Uh, Raph was the hothead. Donatello was the thinker. He was the inventor. And then you had um, Mike, who was the... Or Michelangelo, who was the... Uh, yeah, we can fall down manholes. So we've got to be careful. Uh, Mike was the party animal. He was like the party dude, which was quite cool. 
Oh yeah, these guys. I remember these from the show, they're annoying. They do quite a bit of damage as well, looking at that, Jesus. Okay, now we can move on. Yeah, they can grab you from behind, which is really irritating. Oh, damn it. Now, obviously it might seem like I've got a lot of lives. I've changed it the options menu to get as many as possible, only because I do not know this game at all. And I want to give myself the best chance of actually being able to finish it. So I know these beat em ups can get quite tough. So yeah, I just wanted to give myself the best chance of actually finishing it for you guys, but I have set the difficulty to normal, so it shouldn't be too too easy. Oh yeah, those bomb boxes are something I read about in the game manual. If you use them, it'll actually take a life off you. And there's no real need to use them if you uh, if you deep half decent in the game. Which I'm not saying I am by any means. Now, it seems like you get a full life restore when, uh, when you beat a boss, so I think it's... Metalhead. Ooh, okay. I'm gonna mangle you green slime balls. I don't think you will, man. Simi is just so quick, you can just land attacks really rapidly. Oh, damn. Okay. Yeah, maybe not the... Maybe not be too trigger happy with the with the special, huh? There we go. <laughs> Dive down here so we don't get blown up by Metalhead. <laughs> <coughs> I I love it. I think it's great. I wish I had this as a kid. Like there's some there's some um sewer surfing. There are some games. Like this, that was like so hard. Like Battle Toads, Battle Maniacs. I've never finished it. Oh, it's a bonus stage. Cool. Ah, oh, cool, 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 cool. I'm guessing the more you kill, the better score you'll get. That's my guess. Whoa, he jumps. Okay, you just got to be a bit pro more proactive with the blue ones. Okay. Whoa, okay, I nearly fell for that. Didn't need the pizza, but thanks anyway. Ow! That really hurts. Whoa. Whoa. We're playing our type. <clears throat> okay. So again, you got to be a bit more proactive with these guys. What are they? Some sort of sewer monster, I guess, but... Thank God I didn't miss that. Oh, we got a life. That's awesome. Pizza Monster. Wow. A boss on a bonus stage? Oh, it's the Rat King. First the sewers, then the world. Okay, we've got to be a bit more careful. That's not being careful. That special does so much damage. And on a boss, I don't mind doing too much because we're going to get a health refill in the next stage, so... 
Are we at the Technodrome already? Yeah, this is the Technodrome. This is like Shredder's like hideout. Technodrome. Let's kick shell. Let's kick shell. Oh damn, these guys again. Look at how much damage that does, holy hell! Okay, little robot dogs now. Don't know what they do. On the base, they didn't get a chance to do much. Oh, they sort of stop you attacking for a minute. Turns out I suck. <clears throat> oh, are those guys blocking me? Oh, Shredder's on the screen, look. Okay, I guess we can't go any further, so... A boss? Already? Must say, have fun. Okay, this is Toka. And Raza. I don't remember these from the cartoons. I'm guessing they were comic books. Okay, I've got to be a bit more careful because. Damn it. Losing lives like anything's business now. You can land a lot of attacks, but you've got to be really careful because after a while they just bust through. Oh, we're going somewhere else. Where are we off to now? Oh, okay. Is this going to be an elevator section? Yes. I'm guessing we're going to go to like a multitude of floors and then they'll uh, get harder and harder. This is cool. Oh god, no. Luckily they've got no aerial attack, so that's something. What's next? Oh, dogs, okay. I don't think they can actually... Oh, they can. Damn it, man. We're, we're chewing through lives at the moment. We've got to be more, way more careful. Can, is there any other way to get lives apart from the bonus stage, I wonder? Such a good room clear of that. <clears throat> any more for any more? Oh, okay.
I'm not sure how to get rid of this guy, I'll be honest. I think you just have to wait for an opening. Oh, we're going straight through. Guessing we're done with that section then. Oh, damn. We're going to fight Shredder? Oh, hello, what's going on here? Oh, I get it. I think I get it. Yeah. Damn. Being held like that is lethal. Again, guys, do remember, I have never played this game before, so I know I suck, but there is a reason for it. There is so much happening. Got it? You done? Nice. <laughs> My patience is wearing thin. I'm banishing you to a time warp. Interesting. So where are we off to? Oh damn, we've got some chrono trigger level of crap going on here. Prehistoric Okay. Well, before we get into that, guys, I've got to actually end the episode here, because obviously this is going to be a new level, I'm guessing. So I'm hoping we have a bit of time at the start just to stop. Yeah. Because you can't actually pause this game. So thank you very much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, it's all right, April. Calm down. And I'll see you in the next episode, guys. Thanks very much. Bye for now. Have a great day.